Hey, it's Kathy, and I just got off Zoom with a client who uh, who told me we discovered the missing link for her week. So I wanted to talk about that because she was talking about the disconnect right now between her beliefs and her parents, right? Like a lot of us <laughs> in um, COVID times have beliefs that may not you know jive with our families or a friend or or whatever and she said we couldn't find anything to talk about right we were together and we just couldn't find that and so this missing link she realized she can apply in her business she can apply with her parents she can apply with her kids she can apply with her clients um and she said so somewhere else she can apply it to which i've forgotten um, and it's this, right? Everybody, so I'm going to take my massager for a second, right? Okay. This, by the way, is one of the best massagers I've ever had. I soup, I love it. You can do it to yourself. But anyway, it's like a guy thing, I think. Um, anyway, so everybody, like this person here is the most important person in their life. I mean, they might say that their kids are the most important, but really, or they might say their spouses, but really this person is the most important person in their life. And everybody wants to be seen, wants to be valued, wants to be heard, wants to be loved, right? So if you are willing to just find out, hey, what's important to you right now? Like, what's the most interesting thing going on in your life? And whether this person is a bum on the street or a celebrity or anything, like, they want to be valued. That's uh, human nature. Mm -hmm. uh, your child wants to be valued. What's the most important thing? Or, like, I was talking with her. You could find, maybe you disagree on things right now and what they would talk about is like, what I value is getting the vaccine and you don't want to go there. Okay, tell me about the coolest place you've ever been. Tell me about one of the sweetest memories you've ever had, right? It's shifting the energy onto something positive. And then you get to hear about that. I did this with my husband's grandfather. He was parked in front of the TV, as he often was, and um, I discovered something about him that was super cool. I didn't know, and in fact, my husband didn't know, and his mom didn't know. <laughs> like, um, And so he was parked in front of the TV while we were having a family gathering. And I went in, I started talking to him, and I said, hey, you know, what is the most interesting place you've ever been? And he goes to Iceland and he lit up and he started telling me all about the wonders of Iceland. And I was like, oh my gosh, now I want to go there. Um, I had wanted to before, but then I really wanted to. And, and it just brought such juiciness to him. And I discovered something and then later I shared that with my, you know, my husband and his mother. And like when you're willing to have this attitude of being an explorer and I'm going to excavate something precious. I'm going to excavate something interesting, something beautiful. It's really powerful and it's powerful for connection. And that's what we all want. We all want connect. We're all looking for connection on a deeper level. So I hope that was useful for you. It was just a nugget that came out of our coaching session today. And um, it's, yeah, so for what it's worth, sub hit subscribe if you enjoyed this um, or like or both. And um, I'll be back with another little tidbit later in the week. Thanks a bunch. Aloha.